All right, YouTube Axis and Allies brethren, welcome back to Tour 2. For this Axis and Allies variant uh, classic edition game between No Limit as the Axis powers and myself, Captain Jack, as the Allies. I apologize for those of you who watched the previous UK video. It's been over 20 years since I've played this game. So there's, uh, and, and uh, I would have read the rule book from cover to cover, but like many of you, I don't have the time to do that. So um, some of these rules have caught me a little bit off guard uh, going back. So um, it, No Limit pointed out to me kindly that in the last, in, in the round that I tried to, um, the turn that I tried to do, I produced an aircraft carrier and put two fighters on it, but you cannot put fighters on the aircraft carrier in the turn in which it was built. So that left little protection for my carrier, my two transports out there all by themselves. So we're doing this turn all over again. So I do apologize for wasting you guys time. I think the video was only three minutes. So hopefully I didn't waste too much time of it. But anyway, so for so to make a correction for that turn, I'm redoing this turn, uh, redoing it all over again. And instead of, um, Instead of uh, purchasing anything, I'm going to roll three tech dice, three weapons development dice to see if I can develop any weapons. Um, and then I'm going to save the other 15 IPCs for the next round. So UK has 30 IPCs to spend um, and they'll have, uh, uh, they'll be spending 15 on tech rolls this turn and then they'll spend another 15 on um, a turn, a roll 15 over for the next turn. Uh, so they'll have 45, um, well, well, don't know exactly how many they'll have left, but they'll have, uh, uh, they'll, they'll roll 15 over for next turn. All right, so, um, actually they will. We will know what they'll have, because they've got 26 now. They've got 26 now, they won't be taking any territories. They'll roll 15 over, so they'll have 41 to spend next turn. Okay, all right, let me grab those dice. Okay, right. so here are the three dice we're going to roll for the tech for the tech turn We need as many sixes as possible to try to even this game out So let's see what we can come up with And we did get one six So we got a six a five and a one so we did get one six So we'll roll that same die And actually we'll roll a different die. We'll roll a red one to see what we get for uh, weapons development for the UK and it was a six so they get heavy bombers so the UK gets heavy bombers I think of all the things they could get that's probably the one thing they needed most would be heavy bombers so that is awesome that and long-range aircraft would have been awesome uh, either one of those so all right so the UK has heavy bombers and they'll have 45 to spend next round. Wonder what they'll be buying or producing, excuse me, producing. Wonder what they'll be producing. I keep trying to, trying to stop using purchasing and buying. All right, so for non-combat movements in this turn, actually, you know, I forgot I'm going to do a bomb and run. Um, so I'm gonna do that bomb and run all over again, no limit. Uh, I think the, the round before, um, since I'm doing the whole turn all over again, I'll give you a chance to shoot down this bomber again and we'll see what happens. So um, let's let's actually do the uh, bombing run uh, for the UK bomber. Uh, and actually because he developed weapons um, and it is a heavy it's a heavy bomber this time. So let me check the rules on that and see exactly what the heavy bomber means. Um, I think I know, but I want to make yeah, sure I was correct on this. So it's three. The, each bomber gets to roll three dice for their attack with heavy bombers, which is an amazing uh, uh, technology to have. Um, anyway, so I'm gonna do that uh, roll all over again for you, no limit. So you do get a chance to shoot down this bomber. So if there's a one roll, it is a hit. Anything else is a miss. One is a hit, anything else is a miss. And it was a three. It was a three. So, let's roll three die to see how much damage is done to the German industrial complex. And we've got 
13. That's a four, a five, and a four. So that comes out to 13 damage. So 13 IPCs will need to be paid back to the bank for the Germans. All right, so we've done weapons development and, and, no, and purchases, which were, there weren't any, or production, there wasn't any. Uh, we've done the combat for the bombing run, and now we're gonna do our non-combat movement. The only non-combat movement I'm going to do is this transport off of India is gonna fly, is gonna move two spaces down to Australia. So it's off the coast of Australia. And that is it for this turn. Oh, no. Uh, uh, the infantry division in Western Canada is gonna to go to Eastern Canada. It moved over to Eastern Canada. Um, let's see here. Anything else? The transport, the UK transport one on the eastern, off the coast of eastern Canada is going to move down one space off the eastern coast of the United States. So it is going to move there and pair up with that transport for, with the US. All right, so that should be it. That should be all the turns. All the moves. The bomber that flew into Germany will fly back to the UK. And that is it. Sorry for thinking on air here, but I uh, just want to make sure I'm not missing something. Okay, so that'll do it for this turn for UK, first round turn. Very productive, I think. I'm glad I got to do it all over again and make that, uh, make that uh, uh, change my mind. Um, no Limit, thanks for pointing out that rule and thanks for letting me do this turn again. So hopefully it'll be a more competitive even in match game uh, this way. All right, so from turret two, Captain Jack, over and out.